Let the heart dictate. 1st John chapter 3 and verse 21. Beloved, if our heart does not condemn us, we have confidence toward God. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Psalm 51 and verse 10. It is apparent that it is outside of us that can clear the rubbish that is in us. At the time when we sincerely and genuinely repent of our sins, Yahweh takes us to Jesus where an everlasting bond is formed and a great transformation takes place. Our sinful nature no longer dominates our thoughts, words and actions, but we are henceforth controlled by the Holy Spirit as the Spirit of the Living God abides within us. 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 17 says, Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. Old things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. Herein is the purpose fulfilled by the death of Jesus on the cross. The reconciliation of God and man. We are now made bold to call God Abba Father. Standing before him with all humility and a clear conscience requires the righteousness of Jesus Christ to be infused in us by our seeking. The Holy Spirit sweeps clean our hearts from all kinds of demonic influences and then we have to be vigilant to ensure that they do not return with seven more dangerous demons, demons who make our state worse than it was before. Only Christ Jesus must have the sole occupation rights of our hearts. Our clear conscience through Jesus Christ will provide us with the confidence to approach Yahweh in all His holiness and we can then enjoy true, open and blissful fellowship with the Triune God. Hallelujah and Amen. God commands, let the heart dictate. And that's in 1st John chapter 3 and verse 21. Beloved, if our heart does not condemn us, we have confidence towards God.